Thanks, Marcella. It's time for my final thought, which I'm going to open with a question. Did you make it down to club quarantine this weekend? Well, why not? I put you on a guest list. I even reserved you a spot in the VIP. Saturday night, Derek Jones, known professionally as D Nice, opened the virtual doors to club quarantine, giving us the stress relief we needed. Alone in his Los Angeles living room, armed only with a webcam, turntables, an occasional drink, and a rotating cast of hats, he hit us with nine straight hours of classic soul, R&B, old school hip hop, salsa, and Afro world beats. He even played a little Kenny Rogers, and it didn't cost us a thing. This wasn't his first night doing this. He started last Wednesday with about 200 listeners. By Saturday, he had over 100,000, and it seemed like a lot more than that. Felt like all my people were there. And like any other hot spot on a Saturday night, the celebs came through too. Everybody you love made an appearance. Hallie came through. Ellen came through. Bradley Cooper came in. Beyonce's mama showed up. Jamie Foxx was in the building, along with Janet Jackson, Oprah, and Marky Mark, or, you know, Mark Wahlberg, as his ID said. And then Michelle Obama came in. And we knew because D made it a point to let us know when they came through the door, which had me adding a new goal to my vision board, get famous enough to get a shout out from the DJ when I come into the building. At one point in the night, Joe Biden and Bernie Sanders or their social media people popped in. Maybe that's how we should finish this nomination process with a dance battle. D Nice ended his set at two in the morning, but not before promising to pick it back up on Sunday, which he did. And he also inspired other DJs, Questlove among them, to go live and turn their parties out. This moment came right on time. After spending the last week doing our best to stay apart, it was great to feel connected again. So thanks to D, we were able to have what felt like a regular Saturday night hanging out with friends, and I got to dance with Halle Berry. I've been wondering if we Americans were going to have our own balcony moment how we were going to come together and get our minds off where we're going to get more hand sanitizer, and it came Saturday night. A DJ may not have saved our lives, but he did lift our spirits. We're going to continue this conversation online. You guys have a beautiful Monday. Stay safe. Keep your distance. Get up, DC.